again. All right, be careful. Sup, Charlene? Um, you ever met? We haven't actually met. I'm uh, Howie Rotman. I work with Peter at the law firm where I make a lot of money. Yeah, yeah. yeah so. Boy, it's hot out here, huh? You must be getting a little clammy in that outfit. If you're not, I got a bathing suit store in the club. I'd be happy to go with you. You know, if you need someone to watch you try some on. <laughs> nah, I'm cool. What are you peeping at? Love your weave. Well, what, you gonna take a picture? Is you pushing up on me? Not yet, but I'm hoping. You're the bomb. You feel me? <laughs> Damn. Boy, talk nerd like you heard, okay? We get along just fine. Yeah, okay, no problem. We'll just be friends. Kidding. This is how white people act. Hola. Did you have a big party last night? Uh, more like a riot. Thank you, Rosa. See you Wednesday. It was a good party, though. It was hot. <laughs> now, the point around which your life now revolves is that you must never be seen by Mrs. Klein. Understood? Why I gotta hide from Miss Klein? Mrs. Klein. Because she is my neighbor and because she is my boss's sister. And we've never had any problem, and I don't want anything Ooh. here that's going to... You bought this house on purpose so you could live next door to your boss's folks? What? <laughs> Damn, P. Diddy, that has got to be the biggest, most expensive ass and move I've ever seen. Uh, that is just... Doing the no, most. no, that... You, oh, well, you that is that the dumbest... Oh, right. Oh, yeah, right. Hey, Georgie, how about you and I practice some reading instead? Playing video games. Okay, buddy. Well, a little later then, okay? Yeah, sure. What's wrong with the little crumb snatcher reading? He can't. Um, Daddy, I, uh, I have a lot of studying to do, so um, I'm just going to skip dinner. Good girl. Thanks. Well, let's get started on your case. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. I got to show you some things. Aren't you kind of hungry, though? Look, Matlock, save the speech, please. I just want to clear my name. Fine, but it's going to take some time. And we're going to have to discuss the way you present yourself. Oh, you want to change my style? Well, like nobody recognized me? All right, hey, you buying? Something very plain, quiet, puritanical. Spandexy, glittery, kinky. Uh, high neck. With cleavage. You know, show them if you got them. This much ankle. Above the knee. Wool. Animal print. Preferably African. One look should say librarian. You know, don't be half a hoe. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm getting a very mixed message. Perhaps you and your... should consider another store. You feel me? This is what I'm talking about. I know it's Imagine. hot, but no, the hot is not what we're talking about. Hot as in cool as in... Yeah, but that's like the old you. Sexy. I mean, you could be a sexy nanny. You yeah, don't have to be like. like you know, the snaps, because they snap down here. I mean, they just snap them open. That's right. Yeah, I mean, dead that's easy crazy, access you know, but, to the ladies' room. I mean, uh, okay. you know. Right. It, says it snaps. Well, I think you look great. <laughs> this is gross. Hey, yo, this is freaky. I look like one of them church bras that sit on the parole board. Well, look on the bright side. A taxi might actually stop for you. Watch, sucker. Give me.
Oh, uh, yeah, sure, sure, yeah, yeah. What are you doing? Oh, bad luck! Oh, oh dear, hard oh, cheese. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> well, you beat me by 19. Uh, let's make it 20. All right. Uh, Mrs. Arnest, I was wondering if you'd like to come over to my house on Thursday and uh, possibly look over the contracts. Uh, well, I'll have to check oh, with I'm Julia. I'm very impressed with your knowledge of the law. Well, you know, I just love to read. It's, it, I mean, it's just really something I like to do. And, and me, I'm just attracted to intellect. Mrs. Arnest, would, would you excuse me for a minute? I just have to check on my children. Oh, of course. You do that. Would you like some help, ma'am? Yeah. Who are you? I'm your caddy, ma'am. Oh, stay there, will you? Thank you. I was not humping my nanny. Peter, surely you understand that if Mrs. Arnett were to suspect any instability on your part, there is no instability in my home. If you don't mind, I'd like to get back to work. I hope you're telling us the truth. All right, you know what? I'm going to remain very calm, and I'm going to keep my distance, because if I don't, I may do some serious damage. Why? Oh, don't be coy. When you humped Charlene on a couch last night? I did not. I was at the door, Peter. I heard everything. Nothing happened. What? Nothing happened. Oh, that's good, because well, I was ready to kick some ass. Drinks later? Okay. What the? What up, dog? Get out, slut. No, baby, you're not going anywhere. No, no, no. What? Come on, baby, please, please. Stop. Come, come, come on. Damn it! And who the hell are you? You know, you really hurt Sarah's feelings. You got about two minutes to apologize. Kiss my ass, huh, bitch? Hmm? Yeah. You better start praying to whoever it is you pray to, because it's about to start raining bitch slaps up in here. Come on, then. Please don't kill me! Oh, God! What are you, crazy? Pull me up! What do you want? Shut up with them stinking feet! Sarah! What? Mike has something to say to you. Say sorry. I'm, I'm sorry! Say sorry! I'm sorry again! Say sorry for I'm sorry, you. God! I have Say no means no! Don't kill me! No, I'll drop you. What are you, crazy? No means no! Don't drop me, please! Uh -huh. Oh! No, he's no! No! Oh! 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 Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs>